What is going on you guys? Welcome back to another video. It is a beautiful day today, man. And I'm heading to the gym right now. It's like 90 degrees out. But it's honestly not that hot. It does not feel like 90 at all. It's probably because the sun is pretty low in the sky now, but yeah. Anyways, look at me in the shadow. For quote of the day today, our quote of the day is that we're the ones who get to die. We're the ones that were born. Out of all the people that could ever be born, you were born. And so you get to experience life. And you get to experience death. Death is just a part of life. Like there's just the only thing that's ever guaranteed in life is that we're gonna die, pretty much. But we're the ones who get to experience that because there's so many people who will never be born. And you were someone who got to be born. And you get to experience life. You literally won the lottery of life. And there's some people don't even know the lottery existed. That all comes from um, uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson. Yes, I heard that quote from him. And oh my gosh, dude. It's crazy because he did the actual numbers. I didn't do the numbers. I don't remember the numbers that he said, but he did the actual numbers. And it's a lot, man. There's a lot of people who will never be born compared to the amount of people who were born. And so if you were born, bro, you get to experience life. Live every day to the fullest and do whatever makes you happy bro because we only get one of these things and once it's over it's over so don't leave with any regrets okay now i'm starting to feel the sun a little bit not too bad but a little bit oh my hair is in my eye i just made it worse to be honest
backpack is so heavy right now. I have so much shit in here. I have my water, which is like full, full of 60 ounces. Build up my belt, my shoes, my wallet, my fucking lock for my lock at the gym, bro. Like, holy shit. off after I get out of the gym also. If not, this is going to be like a 10 minute video. I like to make them a little longer. Resume the video after I get about the gym. And my hair is in my damn eyes again, bro. God damn, this thing is loud, bro.
Oh my god, I forgot I was recording. Oh shit. <laughs> I was just riding, dude. I forgot I was fucking... <laughs> I totally forgot I was recording, bro. I was just vibing. Well, I was just thinking, I was at the gym and I just finished and this dude came up to me and asked me if I work on my bike. I said yes. And he said that he had his bike that he was working on and he said that it will ride for it rode for like a little bit and then it started dying out it wouldn't go past 10k it would, and then it wouldn't go past 8k and then it wouldn't go past 6 and then it's like stuck down there I told him I don't know maybe it's a stator but he said here he rebuilt the whole bottom end of it so I don't know if any of you guys know what that possibly could be let me know in the comments and if I see him again I will tell him because that shit sucks bro he said he'd been trying to work on it but he can't figure out he rebuilt the whole bottom end he had like he even had a battery he says the reason he doesn't think it's a stator is because he had a battery hooked up to it and it still was doing the thing where it was dying like it would go it would ride fine and then it would go to 10 and then it would go to 8 and then it would just slowly like limit all the way down and down and down so I said I have no idea bro but that fucking sucks so if any of you guys know what that might be after a little while of him riding it gets stuck here and then it kind of goes down like slowly 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 and it won't go past that rpm let me know in the comments because if I see him again I'll maybe suggest to him but say he's gonna try to find somewhere to work on it but it's hard to find reliable bike shops bro trustworthy people to work on your bike, you know? Just chilling on the fucking barrier. Oh hell yeah, he had a fucking bottle of crush in his hand. Bro was chilling. God damn, this guy is popping. Oh, that one feels good, bro. to his own shadow. Sounds like somebody is mentally unstable. I can't, dude. I don't want to get boxed up in the four white walls, but I might have to, bro. Just saying. I don't like the padded room where everything is white, but that might be my new home from now on. If they catch me, that's where I'd be end up going, bro. That might be where I'd be end up going.
policía I love there's a wall next to me because my bike is so loud. I'm gonna be respectful of the people that live here. I go flying through their neighborhood. Oh my gosh. The dinosaur house is coming up, guys. This guy always hands out like massive candy bars on Halloween. And he has like huge ass dinosaurs in his yard, bro. Look at this shit. Look at those dinos, bro. I stand up in the white walls, bro. That was... I don't even know. That was not me, bro. I don't know who the fuck that was, but... Not me, bro. Oh, no. I'm behind Granny Granny. Granny turn. Um, I'm just gonna head around. Here, pardon me. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe, spread some love, and peace out. <laughs>